So we've discussed how to make a video call, how to join a meeting, how to post in the general channel. The other thing your teacher may do is post assignments from time to time. So it's important that you know how to find them and then how to actually access them. Okay, so if your teacher posts an assignment, what you'll see if you go into your Teams app and you just click on, let's say I just click on my testing group, then you can go to this tab, the assignments tab. Okay, and if you go there, you will see um any of the assignments okay so you'll you'll be able to select an assignment so if i go here uh, there's nothing there right now but if there was an assignment it would be sitting there okay and i could click on it and i would be able to access it let's see if there's any in here that i can click on so it's not set up there either but if you go into that assignments tab you, that's where you will see all of your assignments. And what will happen um, if you do that is then you will be able to actually, once the assignment's there and you can click on it, you'll be able to actually do whatever it is that they want you to do. So you just click on that and it lets you access the assignments. Okay, now, uh, once you've got an assignment and you've turned it in, uh, then so actually I'm going to scroll up here and you'll notice there is an assignment right here so it also shows up in the post so if I click on view assignment um, then it will allow me to see it okay and then you can turn it in up here this is turning again because it's already been turned in but you can turn it in again but you can basically do this okay and down here you'll see this is a the blank assignment and you can actually use that if you want to to fill it in or you can download a copy of it and then fill it in but if you so you can click and edit this okay and then you can turn it in or if you want to do it on your own you can down here you can click on add work okay and if you want to add work, you can add your own document. So that kind of helps you with, and then up here, you turn it in, okay? And then if you go to grades, which is jumping ahead a little bit, I know, in terms of this, but you can see that this was returned, okay? So you can actually see the assignment, you can see that it was returned, and there were no points attached to it, so you can't see what you got, but that's where you would find out what you got, okay? So once you turn it in, uh, then that's how you will get it back. So you can click on your assignment to see your grade. You can look at your assignment tab and look at the ones that are completed. Um, so in here, what that's saying is I can go here and I can click on completed. And I will see there it is and I can click on it. Okay. Or you can go to grades. So that's how you can see it. Okay. So hopefully that helps you with assignments.